Sayyid says, is creating games to earn money haram? The answer is no. Creating games in general is halal, providing that the games themselves are halal. So if you create a game that is innocent, it's like, you know, in the, back in the day, we used to play Atari, which is the generation before Nintendo, which is definitely before uh, PlayStation, whatever. So Atari, it was a very simple game where you could play uh, handball with a wall or with a computer, where you get um, uh, drones dropping bombs and you had these uh, cannons that used to kill them when you used to play with Pokemon, uh, not Pokemon, what's it called? I, I don't know, this the, the thing that eats um, the things, I think it's called, called Pokemon, Pokemon or something like that. So uh, all of these things were innocent. So if there is no music and you design such innocent games, this is halal. Making money out of it is surely halal. There's no problem in that. But when you make a game like playing uh, poker or blackjack or roulette, if you make a game that involves girls and boys and you design human figures, and this is not permissible. If you design something that provo promotes uh, uh, violence and killing, like this PUBG and, and uh, Fortnite, we've seen the massacres in El Paso, in, in Ohio, in different uh, uh, um, American states. Very sad and unfortunate. But where did this violence come from? From selling arms, yes, openly to wackos and to uh, maniacs. You can buy a gun easily. The restrictions they put is pathetic. But also these video games influence the children while they're growing up. So it, it becomes like programming them to be susceptible to violence and inflicting harm to the others as part of winning or expressing their rage. So designing such games and making money out of it is haram and Allah Azza wa knows best.